So do you get complaints from people that they keep hearing themselves back when they're on a call with you on Discord or Zoom or anything else? This is the video for you, so let's get right to it. Now the problem you're facing is referred to as mic feedback or mic looping, which means that whatever goes through your audio channel which you hear on your headphones also goes through to your mic channel somehow. Now this mainly happens because of poor shielding between the components inside a laptop or a desktop. So if you're using onboard audio, which means that you plug in directly to your laptop or your PC, then you're more likely to be having this issue. So how to solve it? Now there are a few software fixes available which you can try first. If it solves it, you're good to go. But if it doesn't, there are hardware options down the road as well. So here are the software ones. First up, you need to go to your sound settings and go to your recording devices, find your microphone, and check the microphone volume and boost. Reduce the boost as required and check if the volume is sufficient enough and is not looping. If it is still looping, keep watching the video. If you're running relatively new Windows computer, you're most likely running Realtek Hi-Def Audio, which means that you should have a Realtek Audio Control Panel, which should allow you to add some effects to your microphone. The three things here you should be looking for, unidirectional microphone, the second one is acoustic echo cancellation, and the third one is noise suppression. So just enable all those and uh, you should definitely see some difference in what you were experiencing. Now you've gone around and tried all of that and it's still not working, let's look at the hardware option. First up, the cheapest option is to get a sound card which you can get for $2 to $10 once you get to your sound card, you gotta plug in the microphone on the sound card and the headphone on the onboard audio, which means you're physically separating the two inputs and that means that there should be no interference between the two. So that should fix the issue. If that sounds too complicated, this is the other option. The audio you're hearing right now is from a Boya BYM1 mic, which is right on, on my shirt. And that is actually costing less than $20 US. So on sale you can probably find it for ten dollars maybe and that actually sounds pretty good you can use it with laptops dslrs phones etc so yeah that should be the next hardware you should be looking to separate the mic by using a y adapter that will split a single headphone jack into two jacks which means one is for mic and one is for headphones so you can plug in one of these mics and have your audio separated that way. Now if you've tried all of the things I've said before and you were saying, oh, I'm still having problems, there is one solution. It's called USB audio. And more specifically, it's USB mics. Look into condenser microphones such as Blue Snowball, Blue Yeti, or Fifine if your budget is tight. You can get a good microphone for as low as $40 or maybe $50 and it will sound much, much better than what you have on your headphones or earphones or your built-in laptop mic. One general rule of thumb is to always use headphones while using any voice chat applications because if you're using any sort of speaker or surround system, then the audio will feed back into any of the mic you're using unless it's a really expensive shotgun mic which focuses just on your voice, you're gonna have problems. So just a general advice to end this video. Anyway, Thanks again very much for watching. I hope you liked it. Give a thumbs up, it really helps out. Subscribe and ding the bell just down there and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.